Hi, it's Carrie from Garden Rudiments. Thanks for watching today. I'm here to tell you about a great deal that I got at my big box store today. And I was so excited about it. All I could do was just think, okay, I have to make a video on it. I have to tell you about it. So stay tuned. So besides the good deal that I got today, I have to show you something that I got as an early Christmas present. I was really excited about this when she showed it to me and brought it in. Uh, my son and daughter-in-law came to uh, have Thanksgiving dinner with us and she brought me a sweet gift. See my little greenhouse? Isn't it perfect? It lights up, it's got little trees in it, it's got people in it. Just adorable, I'm so proud of it. So she told me that they have these, I'm going to tell you which stores, they have them at Walmart and Lowe's. So I haven't found the other pieces at our Lowe's here, but I'm going to look at some more places to see if I can get some things to go with this, because this is just adorable. And it's well made, it's kind of heavy, and I think it'll be a great piece to have for years. And I actually plan on putting it out in the greenhouse for Christmas. So stay tuned on this, this is really a good gift. And the next thing at my big box store that I went to, uh, I always go in and look because this time of year, especially they get a lot of new plants. I always look for echeverias. I order echeverias online because it's very hard for me to find them here where I live. Just every once in a while, you'll find them at the big box stores and when I go to do arrangements, that's one thing I never have enough of is Echeverias, something that looks, you know, like a rosette. I'm not sure which one this is. It doesn't have a name on the pot. It rem it's very close in resemblance to an Echeveria prolifica. As you can see, it has babies. And there was like five of these plants there, and they all had babies, some two and three. But this was the only one that looked this good. It didn't have any um, yellowed leaves. It does have some dry ones along the bottom, but that's okay. But it has little red tips, but the center does not look like a prolifica. So I'm not sure what it is. I know it's an Echeveria, but it's just a little bit different. The leaves are a little bit flatter and not as full. It's not a hens and chicks, but uh, I'm just not sure what this is but I'm very proud to have it. These were $4.98, so I think that's a good price, and they had a lot of new plants in. So for my great find, this is Hummel's Sunset Jade, uh, Crassula ovata. When I first saw it, I thought, ogre ears? No, it's just a jade, but it does have the little flat shaped with the oval like you would see on the, uh, the ogre ears. Beautiful plant. And I'm gonna move these out of the way so you can see it a little bit better. There are 14 plants in this pot, unheard of, of the same plant. And they all look good. And this plant was on clearance. It was $24.98. When I picked it up off the clearance table, it was only $5. So the first thing that I did was I counted all the plants, all the individual plants I could see in this pot. So $5 is a great deal. And plus I was buying my little $5 Echeveria. So I take it up to the cash register to pay for it. And she looks at me real funny. She said, this only rings up at $1.56. I said, I'll take it, it's mine. Any deal like that is great. $5 was great for a $25 pot. And although these were on clearance, they are overwatered, but there are, I don't see any bugs. There's no mealy bugs, nothing that I can see right off hand that's wrong with this plant. It may have been there for a while. It actually has some dust on it. Uh, they only had two of these pots left. I guess they figured they weren't gonna sell. So I was very proud to get this. I would've went back and got the other one, but, I didn't need that many plants, 14 more of these, because these are gonna be individual plants for me. When I'm doing an arrangement of succulents, I like to have a tall element 
So this gives me 14 tall elements or 14 individual elements that I can put in pots. I'm very proud of that. And then another thing I never have enough of when I'm trying to make an arrangement is the Echeverius. And then I have plenty of fillers. Anything that I can use, you know, as a filler, I have. It's just things like this with height um, and then beautiful shape like the Echeverius have, the rosettes. That's what I'm usually looking for. But I had to let you in on this great find. You never know what you're going to get when you check on the clearance table. This is a great buy. I'm going to repot it because it is kind of soggy soil. I'm going to individualize the plants and I'll use these in arrangements or just have them in the greenhouse. But I'm very proud of them and I thought you might appreciate this good buy. So $1.56 for 14 plants. You can't beat that. So thank you for watching today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please hit that subscribe button. I'm trying, I'm pushing towards that 1000 mark. I'm almost there. So if you can share and hit the like button and help me hit to, uh, help me get to that 1000 subscribers milestone. It is a milestone. I really appreciate it. So thank you. And I hope you have a wonderful Thanksgiving and I'll see you in a few days.